against it was posted on a whole bunch of people's Facebook pages. It was really enough. There was one girl kneeling on her chest, punching her repeatedly, and people around her kicking her. It was awful. <coughs> your story to the police as soon as possible because the longer you wait the less likely they're going to listen to you because they're going to say to you well why didn't you come to us and it makes it seem like you're hiding something <laughs> they shouldn't get away with assaulting her like that period if she doesn't tell the police right now what happened the longer she waits the worse it looks for her because that shows you're hiding something or whatever so what i'm what i can do for you and and to the police, to, to the hospital, and they could never do it. If that's okay with me, I think it's the right thing to do. You gotta hope at the end of the day that somebody does the right thing. And just take it All I can do is advocate for these patients as hard as I can. And which is what I did today. I, I took the time to call the lieutenant, I took the time to set this up to the police, I talked to the nurse, talked to the doctor, and all I can do. I'll never know what really happened because I wasn't there. But it's not like this should not happen to anybody. We are going to hair canals for the man down. So he's had to go and make sure he's doing all right. He needs uh, any sort of medical service and stay in the hospital. Hang on. Well, he's up and walking. He's kind of trying to fight people right now. Hey! Jellylicious.